Ugh, it's making me teary eyed. He made a steak dinner, like the best steak ever, and a few hours later my water broke. <laughs> and that name is... She is here, and she is healthy. Hello. Hi. What's going on? Well, we just had a baby. Yeah. <laughs> Yesterday. And I just took a shower, and I feel so much better. You're looking beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. We had a baby girl yesterday on July 14th at 5.30 a.m., and it's just crazy that she's actually here. I just can't believe it, and she is just so perfect, and we love her so much, and it was honestly just such a beautiful birth experience. The beginning was pretty intense. Yeah. It was pretty painful and everything, but then once I got the epidural, it was amazing. Yeah. <laughs> and it was honestly everything we prayed for, and I had a dream a few few weeks before she was born that I gave birth and in the dream I had said wow this is the birth that we had prayed for and literally the birth experience that I had was the birth that we prayed for so God yeah. has just been answering so many different prayers she's been breastfeeding really good already and last time with my son we had a lot of obstacles with breastfeeding and this time has just been so much easier as of now so that was just another prayer of ours and so God has just been so faithful this whole experience and just super great I am too. I'm grateful that you're safe. and Yes, and I was able to have a V-back successfully, which was so amazing. I just was really, 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 really wanting that. And I'm just so grateful that I was able to have that. And it's crazy. Natural birth is nuts. Yeah. <laughs> and if you have a girl, it's not yeah. so nuts. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so we are going to be going home today. As long as everything continues to go good the rest of the day. We are gonna give her a bath soon and just kind of have a lot of people in and out. It's really hard to get rest in the hospital. Like every time I was literally about to get sleep because she was cluster feeding like all night. So we were already up whenever she decided to wake up, it like was every pretty hour. Pretty much like every 40 minutes. Every 40 minutes, every hour she was eating again. So we were already tired, but then finally when we'd get her laid down and he would change her diaper and then all of a sudden someone's like, no, no, get him like, no. <laughs> this morning finally she kind of took a little bit of a break like we got like an hour of sleep which honestly i woke up like wow that was a great night's rest and i looked at the <laughs> clock i'm like i've been asleep for an hour wow it was really embarrassing because this morning the team of ob's came in and <laughs> they were like talking to me asking me questions and i was laying there and then i remember them asking me something and then also i remember opening my eyes again they're all looking at me and i'm like did i just fall asleep and they're like <laughs> yes so like i fell asleep in mid conversation i have no idea how long i was asleep i'm assuming I mean, it probably wasn't like a super long time that happened to me too yeah but it was just super embarrassing i'm like oh my gosh i'm so sorry they're like it's fine you've been through a lot and i was like i've basically been up for like 48 hours right now he didn't even wake up because he yeah. was knocked out anyways i'm gonna get ready for the day i'm feeling much better though actually i'm really tired but physically i'm maybe it's ibuprofen kick in finally too but i feel more mobile yesterday i just felt like jello i literally just pushed a human outside of yeah. my body as soon as they came out all the nurses were like she's gotta be at least nine pounds and we're like what then they weighed her and they're like okay well i'm surprised she's at least on the eights but she is seven pounds 12.9 ounces which is a lot bigger than i thought i thought she would just barely be seven if she even was everyone i think thought that because she has really chunky little cheeks and they're so cute so i think she appeared bigger and probably honestly i feel like maybe the fact that she had so much hair makes her look bigger too yes. i don't know why yeah, she's a liar. so that's what's been going on and jace got to meet her yesterday and so did all of her parents so also just want to pop on here say we had some good food this morning honestly this hospital food is not bad yeah hospital food was not bad we had a fresh omelet and she had like a skillet she actually got to have hollandaise sauce which was amazing yes. because the first time in a while well, since i've been pregnant some bacon and orange juice so we're just kind of chilling and we're just waiting for some of these protocols to eat to go see jace i'm so excited to get yes him a hug. He's been be back so in her. Much fun at Grandma and Grandpa's, though. Yes. Just excited to go home and excited to just get baby girl in her environment that we've prepared for her. It's going to be a smoother experience than when Hannah had a C-section last time. Yeah, I'm feeling physically. Physically. As of right now, so much better. Hopefully all around, this is just a more physically and health-wise easier experience on us because last time I was difficult she's breastfeeding so that's also gonna make this much smoother i think too we're just excited to get back in our domain we'll show you guys next jace getting to meet her for the first time and then our family so that's right after this hi, 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 hi. hi, hi. hi, hi. hi, hi. hi, hi. can you come say hi to mama 
love you. We have somebody that we want you to meet. Remember when we said that baby sister was in mommy's tummy, honey? It's baby sister. This is, she's, this is your real sister. <gasps> Give baby sister a kiss. <gasps> oh my goodness. Good job. Oh, wow. Good job, That was buddy. so sweet. <gasps> she liked it. <gasps> she smiled. Mm -hmm. Now, she has a mouth. What's that? Is that her nose? That's her hat. hat. No. Do you do you hat. like baby sister? Yeah. That's her eyes. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. Oh look at her. There you are, she sweetie. Baby. Baby. Baby Give her a real gentle kiss. Oh. There it is. Oh, good oh, job, so buddy. Oh, that was good. Can you say bye-bye, baby sister? Bye-bye. See you later. I see you. All right. Oh, oh. What do you think of your new granddaughter? <laughs> She's beautiful. Mm -hmm. She barely has cried. She just like sleeps and then she nurses and then goes back to sleep just like this. I got a little Together. gift for her. Oh. I know you're so excited to <laughs> see that. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, it looks beautiful. Oh my goodness. Sorry. Grandma spent a lot of time on this for you. So, a lot of hard work. Here's the blanket. It's oh, beautiful. You gotta see the tassels. Yeah, she's beautiful. Yeah, look at her hair. hair. Oh my goodness. She is a full head of hair. Let me see. She will be blonde. You think so? <laughs> yes. Oh my goodness. Look at Chase. Your sister, baby sister has a bunch of hair. Mm -hmm. Do you guys want to hold her? I would love to. Okay. <laughs> she's been sleeping for a while, actually. Oh my goodness. <laughs> How cute! Actually, my kids had darker hair than this even. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Justin's hair was probably this color. Oh. Yeah, she yeah. could be a little bit blondie. Hey, baby, welcome to the world. Do you have anything to say to baby? I love you already, and we're going to have lots of fun together. <laughs> She's so cute. She definitely has your lips. Yes. So sweet. Oh, she's opening her eyes. For a second, she did. I'm trying to figure out whose nose she looks like. I mean, she could have her own nose, too, but I feel like I see a lot of Justin's nose in her right now, actually. She'll be changing really quick. Yeah. Oh, she's almost, op almost opening. Almost. You hear a weird voice. Yeah. Look. Oh. Of course, you open up for Grandpa. Yeah. She's weaking at you. Mm -hmm. Hello, baby. She's like, oh, you quit patting me. <laughs> She's like, ah. It's like, hey, would you stop that part? Yeah. She was just grinning. Hi. Hi. Gosh, you know, it just gets a nervous. Oh. <laughs> you trying to say hi? This is so beautiful. This is Grandpa. Oh, you're so precious. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh. Yeah. So beautiful. Don't there you, you go, kitty. <gasps> there you there are. You are the stinker. So there you are. There you are. Oh, oh look at those eyes. What are you yeah. doing? What are you so doing? Perfect. You're gonna have grandpa and grandma on sweet dial. Bless if you, you. Need anything? Okay. <laughs> Bless you. What do you think of baby? She's just gorgeous, beautiful, precious, a blessing. What do you think about that? Huh? Oh wow. Oh, look at how there you are. This is the most she alert she's been in a minute. Grandma's going to take you on a bunch of trips. Don't you want to go to Margaritaville? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. What are you doing? Just smiling? What's going on? Big, beautiful eyes. He made a steak dinner, like the best steak ever. And a few hours later, my water broke. <laughs> She was like, I'm tired of eating this second hand. I want it first hand. <laughs> that smells yeah. really good. I want to go check out where it's coming from. Mm. You are so alert right now. Thank You're you. giving yeah, Grandpa you. and Grandma the show. What a cute little face. Oh, big yawn. What are you doing? Are you being cute already? Hello, Dad. Hello. <gasps> How are you feeling? I'm feeling great. She's really alert right now, and she, we've just been having some eye contact for 20, 30 minutes. Besides when she was first born, this is probably the longest she's been awake. She's just mesmerized by you. You're in your girl dad era. Boy dad and girl dad era. Ready? One, two, three. Oh. 
What are you doing? She looks so cute. She was cluster feeding all night long. Mommy and Daddy did not sleep very much, but that's okay. She's got full belly and she's a good little eater. What is that? There <laughs> you are with your big blue eyes. Do you think she has her lips? I think she has her lips. I don't think she has a blend. Oh my goodness. Oh, I was going to say she smiled for a second. What? She's looking at you. So cute. She's about to get her hearing test. Oh no. Is she going to sneeze? Oh, bless you. Bless you, sweetheart. So we're going home today. Yes, we're going home today. We're going to start life as a family of four. Also, he is very fascinated by the birth process. Because last time, he didn't get to see our son Jace be born. So tell me your thoughts on birth the non-C-section way. I wasn't shocked, I think, like... Oh, no. Like that. Like, oh, I was not, like, petrified or shocked. No. I was just like, wow, this is, like, insane. Like, this is awe. This is... Yeah, to you see know. your daughter come into the world. Yes, it's just such a powerful process. Now you can see your full head of hair. <laughs> yeah, she does. Honestly, I think she has more hair than her brother right now. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this girl. She's so cute. Look at you. You are just the cutest little peanut. All right, say goodbye. Can you say goodbye? Bye. Say bye-bye. We love you. We love you, sweetheart. All right, guys, so we're going to tell you her name, but not before a little story. We're gonna tell you a little backstory to the name. So we were kind of stuck between a few names for a while with her. And we've been just praying that God would just give us wisdom and just give us guys the right name. That is her name. So we were praying about it for a while. And then one night I had a dream. I had gone down this lake, I was sitting in this dock and I was like, God, if you want us to name her this name, I pray that I see a fish and I had not seen like any fish all day. And all of a sudden a bunch of fish just started jumping out of the water. And I was like, okay, God, we'll name her that. She woke up and told me this and I was just, I, at that moment, I think that's when we both knew that we were going to name her this yeah. name because God was like, yes, you know, so. Yep. And that name is? Haven. Haven. So Haven's her first name. So her middle name, my grandma passed away a few months ago and I was very, very close to her. I grew up majority of my childhood living across the street from her. The sweetest lady ever. Honestly, so, so sweet. And, and I amazing in every single way. <laughs> and I was privileged enough to be able to get to know her in the couple years that I knew her. So it was yeah. it was very sad and we both loved her very much. Mm -hmm. She was just so selfless and kind and giving. And <laughs> we miss we both miss her a lot and she played a huge role in Hannah growing up. Lived right across the street from her and just yeah. an amazing woman of God and so anyways. Um, anyways, oh it's like Teary-eyed. So her name was Joyce. And so her middle name is... Joy. <laughs> Joy. So Joy in honor of my grandma Joyce. And it was really special because um, when I said goodbye to my grandma, one of the last things I told her was that we were going to name her because I was pregnant at the time. Her middle name was going to be after her. So that was really special and I'm really glad I was able to tell her that. So introducing... Haven Joy Cook. Yep, so that is her name. And she is just so sweet. I just love her so much. Beautiful, healthy baby girl. And it's yeah. everything that we've prayed for. Um, mm -hmm. And we're just so thankful to all you guys for your prayers. We really feel like they were answered. Mm -hmm. And we just felt God's peace and presence in this room mm -hmm. and in this time. And we felt his grace just carry us through having this second child of ours. And for any of you guys who have children of your own, you know how powerful of an experience and nervous and scary and, you know, faith building it can be. And so just thank you guys for your prayers and support in that area. We definitely felt covered and we are just very thankful to God for answered prayers. So just thank you. And we I can't believe she's here. Yeah. <laughs> she's probably going to have to eat here soon. So yeah. We, we're going to break out of here today. I think we get to break out of here, yeah, because they gave us the okay. So yep. we're going to feed her. I think she gets a bath. And then we are going to be able to uh, bring her home to the environment we have for her at home, which is going to be amazing. Yes. And we're excited to get into our rhythm and be a family of four, be a family of four at home. Mm -hmm.